Sound systems in rubbish bins. A load of rubbish you might say, but actually it's a quite useful and versatile thing and it has a great history. Sunny Beans has been in existence since about 2010. The 240 litre sound systems and now the Skip sound system has been a regular fixture at many events in Sydney. Many councils and schools have used the William and sound systems to great effect. You just wheel them out into place, play some music, do a live performance through them, and people can see solar power in action. The units utilise 12 volt batteries, solar panels, recharging units, to be able to take sound outdoors and use the great Australian sun to keep them going. The Arithmetic Music Workshop was launched in 2017 at Vickers Mill as part of an Inner West Council initiative. Two days were had where music was jammed through the sound systems. People of all ages were able to jam through the various instruments that were brought along. The whole thing was running off 12 volts with solar panels charging up the batteries. People from age 5 to 70 picked up bass guitars, played on synths, iPad apps. The Arithmetic Music Workshop actually has a longer history. In 1996, a group went up to Darwin, a freaky tour on a bus, and we did music workshops up there. And there was one guy, Chris Coe, that came to one of our workshops that went on to become one of Darwin's leading electronic music artists. I met the Arithmetic crew yeah. about 20 years ago when they came to Darwin. And I did their workshop, and oh, it opened up whole new worlds for music making for me. Um, these days, I am a sound engineer, this is my like day job, and then I also run a small record label, I have to make music, and I design new electronic music instruments in software. So yeah, I feel like Arithmetech was really like this thing that kind of started me on that path. I was like, yes, I can do this, and this could be a really fun thing to do for the rest of my life. In these days, nearly all commercial and popular music is made with electronic stuff. So, yeah, these workshops can really like set people on a new path to make awesome new things. The Arithmetic Workshop now is based around Ableton Live. Live sounds can be sampled and mixed with dance beats. Electronic music beats and sounds make a great bed to add acoustic instruments on top of. And it's a great way to bring a jam to life, is using a mixture of both electronic and acoustic music. I had this idea of bringing machine music and organic music, and I play all djembes and things in, in a band. With electronic music, you can create good basses, like backup for you know vocals or instruments. We decided to bring it to the people and get them involved. Many kind of drums, bongos, and I think the good thing about bringing machine music and organic music together is that the machine music creates the platform for the organic music to be safely creative. We saw that happen in, uh, in Merrickville. You know how people feel included, like they feel kind of appreciated. There was this old guy who came and he was my inspiration for the day. He kind of came up and he was watching us and, and, and I just said, hey, go to try me, you know? And, he was really attentive. The next minute, he just exploded. He was like, he was like in Carnegie Hall. You know, he was just like going completely crazy. And, um, and then he, he started. And he grabbed the bass and grabbed it. And he was so excited. I think he left there with like a very different person to when he arrived there. It was quite a big jam, you know. And it was like 10, 12, all ages, you know. Everyone was invited. Yeah, it was great. And there were little kids, you know, from really, really, really small kids who could just like instinctively just bash something. Anybody at any age with whatever talent they have can actually contribute and you can pull out and pull in because when you pull out it doesn't mean it all ends so there's no pressure like it's like and I think that's what they really love when they realize that they don't have to make this all they can just be part of it. Another exciting Sunny Bins installation is the Cabana Tropicana. Cabana Tropicana in Spanish. 
It's a tiki style tropical hut that can be set up at festivals and community events. Everyone loves that, you know? People dancing swim. <laughs> The DJs who play in the Cabana Tropicana specialize in global beats and world music for family-friendly, fun events. Yeah, like world music DJ, exotic art, like original ska, cumbia, a lot of tropical. People love tropical music. Good sound system. For many years running, Sunny Bins ran the mobile carnival sound systems for the Paramasala Festival. Much fun and dancing was had on the streets of Parramatta. Sunny Bins are a great option for your community sustainable event day. From dog shows, with the Sydney of City Council, to Kate Bush most wandering day ever in Sydney Park. To schools and councils who can have a day with music rolled out, soak up a bit of sun, show up some sustainable energy in action. And of course, sunny bins are fine in the pouring rain. If your event gets rainy, these things can still go.